They're, they're very big up front. They're very well disciplined, you know, and they, they're coached very well. They play hard. If, you know, their backs run hard. And, you know, we're not the biggest defensively, but we have some speed and we have a lot of returning experience. So, you know, I feel we played well, you know. I'm excited about what I saw. And, you know, first game you're always going to have people messing up and doing different things. But once we settled down and we played hard, I think we'll be good right. thing with, with all the uh, kids returning and everything on defense, you know, we flew around the ball. We showed, you know, we could be physical and we could fly around and compete with a physical team like Brian, you know, Brad Sport and Brian Welch's crew who puts together a good team. But, you know, I think the worst thing is we ran out of gas. We thought we were in shape, you know, but it's hard to practice and with all the enthusiasm and hype of a Friday night game, you know, that adds additional drainage to you. And, you know, you try to get in shape, but you can't, you can't simulate a Friday night and what you expel during that time. So the kids realize they have to run harder and practice harder this week, and we've done a, you know, I think they've done that, you know. They're really trying to get better and get more in shape. I'm going to admit that we was tired, but we've been conditioning, and he been working us pretty good for this week, so we're going to put on a pretty good show. The key against Washington, they're running the option, is playing assignment football, you know, and all our kids have to play. You know, everybody has to take their pitch responsibility or their dive responsibility, uh, and, you know, do their responsibility and not assume somebody else is going to do it. Quarterback stands out, they have a, you know, they have a hard dive back, he runs real hard. Their offensive line's, you know, real big, and they come off the ball pretty good, so, you know, we're going to each have to do our own. Last year we could pound it at them, offensive line could handle it. This year we have a lot of skilled kids returning, so we're trying to get the ball in a variety of different guys' hands in order to, you know, get touches out there mm -hmm. and spread out the field, make people cover, make people be aware so they can't stack the box. I think as long as we be able to run the ball effectively a little bit, be able to spread it out, make the running game a little bit better. Just got to learn everything, get everything down, make sure everybody knows the reads. I got to pick up on my reads a little bit better, mm -hmm. better look downfield. I had time, just rushed a few throws, but I think if everybody just gets everything rolling together, we'll be able to especially do it effectively. You know, Flannel ran awesome. You know, he ran hard. He ran downhill. He kept his kept his feet going. Made some big plays out of you know not very much, you know. And then you have Floyd Bess, who has great vision and great quickness, you know. So, and then you turn around and you hand the ball off to Possum, and you know Possum has great open field speed and can run the ball hard. You know, we're looking for big things from him. You know, it's a every back we put in there is a different back has different attributes and brings something different to the table. You got Flannels running the ball real good, running up the middle, running down people's throat, and you got Floyd who can outrun people on the outside. It's always nice to have that if I'm struggle in a game, mm -hmm. especially how effective they can be on a good day, especially if the offensive line's feeling good. Well, we thought we had, were narrowing it down, but after, you know, Brassport, we had a couple kids get bunged up, you know, and they're going to be out this week, and so they just slimmed our rotation down. Uh, we're going to, you know, we brought up a couple youngsters, and we're going to try them and give them the opportunity to show what they got. So, you know, with losing two, you, try, you know, we're bringing up two. We're just going to see what they can do and see how they can fit in the mix. They're going to do good. Mm -hmm. we're, we're figuring it out, we're getting everything down, everybody, you know, we had a few injuries, but we got kids that can come in, step in, and get the job done. Mm -hmm. Definitely, be able to, if everybody figures out what to do, everybody kind of work together and talk a little bit more, we'll be able to get it done.